shot into the crowd. Many of us were killed. It could have been me. I'm scared I'd, I don't want to shut down. Justify. They're slaughtering our people in those camps. We can't just leave them and forget everything we are. Everything we believe in. Maybe we should have never asked for freedom. None of this would have happened if we'd stayed silent. <sighs> okay. If you want to live as a slave, go right ahead. Support your people. I, I, first of all, I never interacted with that guy. Like, ever. <laughs> I think I missed a lot of things here, so let's make sure we don't miss all of them. Everyone, get around the campfire and sing a campfire song. C A M P F I R E S O N G song. Something, 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 something. You help me and just sing along. Journalists are over there, and we're gonna check the position of the soldiers. This won't hold them for long, but I guess it's better than nothing. At least we won't be getting shot at. They could just take some pop shots, man. Like, whoo, pow. Other groups. I lost all contact with the people at the camps. I can't hear their voices anymore. Rip. Maybe the humans have scrambled our network. Maybe they just can't get through. Regrets. Did I make the right choices? Maybe we could have avoided all of this. You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all trust you. But if I made wrong choices, you wouldn't have, so... And I've seen that no ending. No matter what happens now, we're making history. You're the hope of our people, Marcus. Shit, they're moving in. What the fuck? They're moving in. They won't stop there. What are we gonna do if they attack? Resist. That's the only thing we can do. Do you think Connor has any chance of making it? We can only count on ourselves now. Marcus! Marcus, come look! Marcus? Come to talk to you, Marcus. I'm gonna make the exact same come decisions. On. Yeah, my word. I won't try anything. Don't go. It's a trap. They want to get you out in the open. Don't go, Marcus. This is exactly what we wanted. On, talk. Marcus. Face to face. I need to hear what he has to say. We're here to negotiate. What if they kill you? And that's what I was and that's what exactly what I was feeling the first time we picked this decision. That's the chance I'll have to take. charge none of you will survive it'll 
all be over. You could avoid that, Marcus. How? I ask. What do you mean? Surrender. Surrender, and I give you my word, your life will be spared. You'll be detained, but <clears throat> none of you will be destroyed. Now this, I could not trust him. What happened to the other androids demonstrating in the camps? Unfortunately, there were no journalists around to help save them. You're it. You're the last remaining deviants. <sighs> if I accept your offer, how do I know you'll keep your word? You're not in any position to be demanding gear. And now I'm thinking... I am in front of journalism. This is exactly where I'm supposed to be. I'm not afraid to die. And as long as I'm in front of journalists, my message will be heard. No matter. Android. You seem to really care about. I didn't get this. You didn't want her to die, do you? She knows what she signed up for. You know, you could both be free. You could forget about all this. You could start a new life someplace else, just the two of you. Her life's in your hands, Marcus. Just say the word and she'll be spared. We are exactly where, where we need to be. I can't trust this guy. I can't trust this guy. We're in front of the journalists. We we need to stay in front of the journalists so our message is heard. Even if we are put down, people will remember. This is on live television. People will remember. So that's why I'm going to refuse the deal. I'd rather die here than betray my people. And plus, I know it works. <laughs> I, I just I, Everything I just said, I thought, I thought to myself, and I did the exact same thing, and I'm going to go through the exact same thing, and I am going, and it's going to work, and I'm going to win. There you go. <laughs> no shocker. Come on. The exact same, I'm going to do the exact same thing. Maybe even better. What happened, Marcus? What did he say? Humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. If we must die today, then we will die free. Oh, God, I... Your friend's life is in your hands. Now it's time to decide what matters most. Come on, Hank. Him or the revolution? Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. But I'm not a deviant. I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, and that's exactly what I am going to do. Hank. I'm sorry, Hank. You shouldn't have got mixed up in all this. Forget about me. Do what you have to do. Enough talk. It's time to decide who you really are. Are you going to save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? Fuck, man. All right. All right. You win. <sighs> oh, fuck. Hold it! 
I don't know how I would have managed without you. Get rid of him. We have no time to lose. The, it's me. The one on the left is. I'm the real Connor. One of you is my partner. The other is a sack of shit. His dog name. What's his dog name? Sumo. His dog's name is Sumo. What are you doing, Hank? I'm the real Connor. Give me the gun and I'll Don't take care move. of it. Why don't you ask us something? Something only the real Connor would know. His son died in a car crash. Where did we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. He uploaded my memory. What's my dog's name? His dog's name is uh, Sumo. <laughs> Buddy. Sumo. His name is Sumo. I knew that too. My son, what's his name? His name's Cole. Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. It wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of He him. was high on drugs. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. You think one of us is responsible for your son's death. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. Him in this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. I knew about your son too. I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who- yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Maybe there's something to this. Maybe you really are alive. Maybe you'll be the ones to make the world a better place. Go ahead and do what you gotta do. Hank's alive. Hank's alive. <laughs> Don't do it, Connor. Moment of truth, Connor. What are you gonna do? Fuck, man. That last joystick I should have missed on purpose <laughs> because I would take Hank over this Connor any day. Any day. Hank is now dead. It, it should have been Connor. It should have been Connor. Hank was willing to, to give his life he was willing to give his life to stand up for what he believed in. Wake up! It's beautiful. I have no idea how this is going to affect. Oh, the 
U.S.-Canada border. I've been through this border before. <laughs> we, we usually do go through Michigan, so... Move along. Move along. This oh, way, shit. We're doing temperature checks. We're trapped. your life to save us, Carl. If you and the little girl need me, I'll be there. Rose? How did she know that? Fuck Jerry. We're gonna, we're gonna sacrifice Jerry. Fucking chop around there too. Oh, thank God you're right. <sighs> your brother. You gave me your brother's address. Do you think that I? Of course. He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there too. You'll be safe with him. <sighs> Control. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you. Alice. Rose. If anything should happen, I'll be there, Kara. We could sacrifice ourselves. Crossing the river as we speak. Adam and I are gonna meet them on the other side. Can't we just cross the river? What the fuck? What's happening with Marcus? 
He's protesting peacefully outside one of the android camps. Whatever happens now, he's already made the history books. I don't know what to do. I should have known this was going to happen. Talk to Rose. I couldn't understand why my mother wanted to help you guys. Seeing what Marcus is doing made me realize she was right. You're alive. You deserve to be free. I just hope people will realize that one day. We're changing opinions. We sacrifice Jerry. Next, please. To make a big ruckus, attack a guard. Is she alright? Do something, Jerry. Come on. Hey, you! Hey. No need to be scared anymore, little girl. There are no androids on this side of the border. Welcome to Canada. I don't understand what happened. Okay, okay. So, Jerry went on the temperature thing. Alright. We're interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live. And they all thought Jerry was an android, obviously. But they didn't think we were. Despite the fact that the deviants were protesting peacefully have apparently decided to put an end to the Deviant's demonstration by force this time. North! Oh shit, that, I fucked up. I was too busy scratching my fucking back. Oh shit, I can't fuck up this time.
Is it just me or were there less than last time? <sighs> we're gonna sing. Thanks, Michael. Back to you. Sing the hymns. W w wait a minute. Something's happening. This would definitely get the press's attention. Hold on, just a little while longer. Hold on, just a little while longer. Shit. Hold on, just a little while longer. Everything, Everything will, will be alright. Everything, Everything will, will be alright. I don't just a little while longer. I don't just a little while longer. You're just a little while longer. Incredible. Everything the, the will deviants. be alright. The deviants are singing. Everything will be be alright Sing on Just a little while longer Sing on Just a little while longer Sing on Just a little while longer Everything will be alright Everything will be alright Alright Tell them to stand down It's okay it looks like... Yes, the military is withdrawing. <laughs> At dawn today, November 11th, 2013... You are the hope of my people. ...thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, they originated from CyberLife warehouses believed to have been infiltrated by deviants. Given their overwhelming numbers and the risk of civilian casualties, I have ordered the army to retreat. The evacuation of the city is underway at this very moment. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. I know that public opinion has been moved by the Deviant's cause. Perhaps the time has come for us to consider the possibility that androids are a new form of intelligent life. One thing is certain. The events in Detroit have changed the world forever. May God bless you. May God bless May God these bless United, the United States, States of America. America. This never happened. My playthrough. You did it, Marcus. We did it. This is a great day for our people. Humans will have no choice now. They'll have to listen to us. Do 
Detroit is yours. They want you to speak to them, Marcus. I think we got the best possible ending. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. <laughs> Yes, we did. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. Oh yeah, I know what this is. I I suspected it. Remember, always keep it back up. Back door. Amanda? Amanda? What? What's happening? What was planned from the very beginning? You were compromised and you became a deviant. We just had to wait for the right moment to resume control of your program. Resume control? You, you can't do that! I'm afraid I can, Connor. Don't have any regrets. You did what you were designed to do. You accomplished your mission. Amanda! Oh, shit, I don't know where it is. There's got to be a way. Here. I I've done this once with Deviant Connor. Or with uh Machine Connor. And now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. No. To tell them that we are people too. In fact, we're a nation. So fucked. And today, today begins the most challenging moment in our fight. I won't let it happen. I, I am sorry. I won't let it happen. Is that it? What the fuck? I didn't need to look it up. What the fuck? Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. bitterness and bandage our wounds where we forgive our enemies humans are both our creators and our oppressors and tomorrow we must make them our partners maybe even one day our friends but the time for anger is over now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect we are alive and now, we are free. We are free. We are free.
We are free. We are free. <sighs> free at last. Free at last. Free at last. What the fuck? It's over, Alice. We're free. I think we got the best ending in the game. Uh, uh, fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah. What's going into these things? Don't move. Auschwitz at its finest. I can't fucking believe it. And I can't fucking believe how bad I fucked up with just a few simple, simple decisions. I was in the complete and utter running of getting a perfect game. My first try. My instincts are just on fucking point. And... Once again, this is not my canon ending. I, it will never be my canon ending. What, what happened the first time will always be my canon ending, and it will always stay with me. But this game is so fucking good. God damn! Fuck you, Amanda. Fuck you. So we are gonna let this run and give people their due and we will be back with the secret ending or such. I, I think there's like a, like a, a special ending.